Hello guys, today I will show you how to install the Dash to your project. The installation process is written on the official website in the main page uh, in installation section. You can see it here. So first of all how you can connect it to your project is just a link to the J JavaScript file in your page. So plain HTML will look like this and you need to provide uh, this script here with uh, URL to CDN of Lodash. Where to get this URL? You can go to the official documentation and here where you have CDN copies in download. If you will click, click on it, then you will see a lot of different files to get Lodash. You can just copy it from here, like I copied it here, and use it. So if we now will open one.html and reload, you will see that in window we have um, underscore and we can use methods for example is array we can use it on array 1 2 and check that it is array and if we import Lodash like this it will be available both in windows and in all newly created functions other way is to download Lodash JS file I downloaded it here and um, I just put it in the source folder and in to HTML it is the same HTML file like before but here I just provide source with lodash.js and it will take it from locally if we will open file to HTML and check we will have the same way for example method is equal or is equal one two will return false so lodash is available and we can use it in any functions and the third way it is the hardest way but uh, it's uh, used most often in all projects as it's more modulable and maintainable for this i'm using webpack uh, here i have config of it webpack config js I just say here that I want to take file entry.js in my source folder and uh, build it to file bundle.js. And uh, you can read more about webpack on webpack.github.io. And um, here I have file 3HTML the same only html here and in source i have bundle jazz which should be generated uh, from entry jazz by webpack and now uh, let's look on entry jazz here i have only two lines the first line is var underscore requires lodash so with this line we want to require lodash as a dependency from npm package in the second line we are using Lodash, for example here we are using is equal method and just console log it. So what should we do to make it work? First of all we need to install Lodash locally. For this I can run npm install Lodash. Install Lodash. I won't run it because I already installed it. The second way what the second step that uh, you should do is install webpack locally and globally. For this you need to run npm install webpack. This will install webpack lo locally and npm install webpack minus g. It will install it globally. And now we can run webpack command and it will bundle our file entry.js and it will create new file bundle.js and if we will look in browser and look on this file 3html we can see in console log false because one isn't equal to and also we can check and in window we also have uh, lodash and we can use any method for example is empty which will return us true 
and uh, this this means that uh, on the first time when you require Lodash in any file of your project, it will automatically um, add it to window, so you can use it anywhere with window also. This is the most commonly used method, like with common JS models. And now you know how to install Ladesh in any project.